Hey, so um, we're going to try a little health insurance math. Um, if you look in your notebook under section uh, 1.03 and find what talks about in health insurance math, um, we're going to go over this paper and we're going to do um, some problems and um, hopefully we can understand what we're doing here. So what, let's do a couple of things. Okay, so we're doing health insurance math. Like this, insurance math. A little hard being left-handed. Okay, so number one says, how much does the health insurance company pay if a person has a $4,000 hospital bill and a $500 deductible? All right, well, it's very simple. Let's look at number one. We have a bill. My bill is $4,000. And I have a deductible of $500. So, how much does the health insurance company pay? All right, so the health insurance pays, well, it's very simple. Subtract these two. I pay this, and once I pay my $500, now just subtract, so my insurance company pays $3,500. So there's my answer, and that is that, and that's a circle there. So the bill was for $4,000. I paid out of pocket $500, and then health insurance pays $3,500. That's how you do number one. Okay, so let me clear that, and let's look at number two. Um, how much does the insurance company pay if the person has a $4,000 bill, a $500 deductible, and an 80-20 coinsurance? Okay, so here we go. We got bill equals $4,000. Uh, my eraser is not working. Hang on, let me clear that. Let's redo that. So number two, let's start over. Number two, four thousand dollar, four thousand dollar bill. We already know we're going to subtract five hundred because that's what I pay. I have to pay that. Um, I paid before insurance before they ever insurance starts. So that's $3,500, and we've already done that. Okay, $3,500. All right, now uh, my insurance pays, if you see an 80-20, that means that the insurance pays this, and I pay that. So off is $3,500, $3,500, then I'm going to take the insurance is going to pay 80% of it. Now 80%, they're going to pay 80%. Keep in mind 80%, I move my decimal two places to the left, so I'm going to say 3500 times 0.80. And when I do that, I'm going to get 28 hundred dollars. That's how much the insurance pay, pays. But what do I pay? Well, thirty-five hundred dollars times twenty percent. Remember, I'm in my decimal two places to the left. So point two zero and I will pay seven hundred. Oops, seven whoa. Scratch that out. I will pay seven hundred dollars. Now, if I add these two together, boom, boom, I get 3,500.
So insurance pays 80%, which is $2,800. I pay 20%, which is $700. So there's number two. Okay, so let's look at number three. Number three says John's employer gave him $2,250, a $2,250 bo mm, $2, bonus to buy optional medical, dental, and disability insurance. The total cost for the year of optional insurance is $2,868. Will you have a deficit or excess of flexible bonus money? What amount of money will be reimbursed or deducted from John's bi-monthly paycheck? Okay, so. All right, so let's look at number three. It's, oh, no. Let's go back to my slideshow. And let's look at number three here. Okay, keep in mind, I'm learning how to make videos. Okay, so. Um. John's employer gave him $2,250. Um, and he actually spent, or what was actually spent was $2,868. Now, first of all, is this more or less? Okay, obviously it's more. So we're going to subtract these two. 250 And we get... Zero, eight, one, we get $618, and this is our deficit. Now, now we're going to take the $618, and we have to split it. So we're going to split $618 into by monthly payments. So what does that mean? What does by monthly mean? That means two times each month. Well, there's 12 months. Therefore, that means therefore, we're going to have 24 payments. So we take 24, divide it into 618, put my decimal there. So 24 uh, divided by 600, I mean, divided 618 divided by 24 is going to equal 2575. So this is what he will pay each um, paycheck. Okay, so there we go. There are the first three, and what we're going to do now is let's see how well you do, and we'll be talking at you later.